What's up guys, welcome to a brand new video. I hope you are doing well. Today I'll be showing you a very nice search tool by Intel Techniques. And if you come over to inteltechniques.com slash tools, you'll be able to use all these search tools here. So these are just different OSINT search tools organized for you here. And this just makes gathering information very, very easy. For example, if you forget how to do a WHOIS lookup on a domain, all you can just do is come over to domains here, put in a domain, I'll put in hailbytes.com. I'm going to populate this. And I can just click WHOIS here and it's going to do a WHOIS search for me. So I don't need to remember the website I need to do a WHOIS search on. So I just need to go over to domains, put in that domain and I'll be able to do a WHOIS search here. The same thing, so you can do different things. You can perform a port scan. Let's try this out. And while this is loading, let's try some other things. So let's try to view a screenshot. So for the port scan, we have HTTP and HTTPS open. So that's a very simple port scan. And this is just queries, search queries done for you right in your browser on the web. And this tries to take screenshots. And this is a very nice tool, very easy OSINT tool to use. I discovered this recently and I'll be using this a lot. So let's check out another category. I'm just going to check out documents. Let's see, Hillbytes. Let's populate all, let's search for PDFs. So we get some PDFs here. So this is a PDF on the Hillbytes GoFish framework. And this just makes OSINT easy. This does some Google docking for you. So if you don't remember how to do Google docking, this will just do that for you. Let's do it on the main domain. Let's populate all. Let's search for PDFs and we get more results here. So let's check out email addresses. Let's see what we can do with that email addresses. I'll just search for info at hillbytes.com. Let's populate this. Let's see scam search. Let's check, uh, have I been pawned? And this doesn't load because the query, probably because the query of have I, have I been pawned has changed. So from this, we see there is no scam report for Hillbytes. Let's see, what more can we do with this? So you have different uh, categories organized for you here. Let's check Instagram. Let's see what we can find with that. Hillbytes, let's populate this. Let's see the IG profile. And this just goes to Instagram.com slash the keyword i'm not logged in let's try to use another tool here and we have the hillbytes results here and this is an instagram tool that just puts in hillbytes as the search term and just makes some searches for us you can see the followers and the following here and this is a very very neat uh awesome tool so this let's see Communities, we have different communities here. You can search Reddit, you can search 4chan, TikTok, Meetup, eBay, Pinterest, Discord. So this is a very good OSINT tool you can start using. This just makes information gathering very easy. So because most times I forget some Google docking search terms and I forget some of the tools I'm supposed to use to gather information and I just use OSINT framework to remember that sometimes I use OSINT framework to remember those tools and to find them. OSINT framework shows you the tools to use. But the interesting thing about Intel techniques is that it does the searches for you. And that's just very cool. So this is how to use the Intel techniques tool sets. And I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you learn something from this CVD. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions about this, leave them in the comments below. Don't forget to also follow us on LinkedIn, Hillbytes. The links that will be in the description below. I hope you're all having a great day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.